Hi, I'm Stephen Simon, co-founder of the Spiritual Cinema Circle, with a look at the films for June, by the way, Happy Father's Day, in the circle. First of all, we're very excited to have our feature be One Small Hitch, and here's the trailer for it. Hello. You are such a bitch. You dump Lance, and then you get engaged to Josh in the same weekend you don't even call us? Whoa, <laughs> where did you even hear that? Why would you tell your parents that we are engaged? <laughs> this is the best wedding gift you could give to your mom. No, you don't need to give me anything. It's from your grandma. If we're trying to convince your mom and everybody else that we're engaged, an engagement ring is a good place to start. I'm not wearing your dead grandmother's stunning VVS1 1.75 carat princess cut diamond engagement ring. She's not even his type. Oh my god, she's totally over. Son of a... How are you gonna raise the kids? Josh was raised in a Jewish home. You're not worried about Molly being Catholic, are you? No! <laughs> yeah, absolutely not. I came here to go to my mom's wedding. Not to sit around, eating rug locks, rug -lock. whatever, with the entire tribe of Israel! You're not worried about Josh being Jewish, are you? Oh, I'm Irish! I want a pot of gold! Where is it? I love pots of gold! Oh, of course no. <laughs> Like what, they're in love? I mean, come on, you've been around them. They're always ragging on each other. You're a child. You're a child. It's poor boy. You wouldn't understand the pressure. I wouldn't understand the pressure? Yeah. My parents are like Jewish parakeets. When are you getting married? When are you getting married? When are you getting married? Get your hands oh, man. I just yeah. heard the news. What? Did you get a promotion? <laughs> well, no, not hey, exactly. This guy just got engaged to my niece. How about that? <laughs> You're engaged. How come we haven't heard one word about how he proposed? You don't think. Morning sickness? Oh, no, he didn't. <laughs> oh, yes, he did. The, the groom's dilemma. <laughs> Choosing between the, the eye carpaccio and the spicy tuna. I think I want both. You can't have both, Josh. Oh, I feel like such a loser. No, no, Molly. Mo Molly. Danger curves ahead. Welcome to the family. <laughs> and our shorts are Shadow. We're very excited to have the writer-director of this film, Autumn McAlpin, with us as our guest in June. Shadow is the story of a young surfer whose life is completely altered and actually shattered in a terrible confrontation, which leaves him with a future that he never thought he would have to face. Do you have any idea what it's like to hobble around all day? and a wonderful dog who comes along and helps him heal. This is a movie about redemption, it's about hope, it's about change, and it's really about understanding that we are not what we do. In Captivity <laughs> is a wonderful film from the USC Film School about a young man in a very interesting exhibit He's a human being. Who are those people outside watching him? Why is he so content eating cereal and watching soaps? And what happens when the right woman comes along? Hi, I'm Jim. There's got to be a way out of here. Do you know where it is? A way out? Shh. Why would I ever want a way out of this place? Shh. This place is great. To show him that his world is not what he thinks it is. The White Box is a fascinating short that raises about 373 questions that you're going to be asking yourself as you go through it. Very difficult to describe this film without giving too much of it away. Suffice it to say, it's about a man on a journey. People who love him, people whom he loves, their encounters, what is he doing, what are they doing, what are they saying to each other, and at the end, what has really happened? What does it all mean? This is a great discussion film, The White Box. Those are our films for June. We hope you enjoy them, and we'll see you soon in The Circle.